The married mother of two has now been fitted with a robot hand that is not only controlled by her brain, but can also feel what it picks up. It allow her to carry out actions that most of us take for granted, but pose great difficulties for amputees, such as getting dressed. The robotic hand simulates a living hand's ability to feel with sensors that can detect information about whether an object is soft or hard. This information is linked to a computer in a rucksack that converts these signals into electronic impulses that the brain will understand. Professor Silvestro Macera, a neuroengineer at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Lausanne, told the BBC, We are going more and more in the direction of science fiction movies like Luke Skywalker's Bionic Hand in Star Wars, a fully controlled, fully natural, sensorized prosthesis, identical to the human hand. Prof. Paolo Rossini, a neurologist at University Hospital Agostino Gemelli, Rome said, Once you can control a robotic prosthesis with your brain you can think about creating one that allows more complex movements than a hand with five fingers. The researchers paid tribute to Al Marina and the other amputees who joined the project. Mrs. Mascarello has kept the bionic hand for six months, but it has now been removed, as it is still a prototype. 